Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Bobby from Bobby's Hobbies. It's Sunday morning. It's November 12th. That's right. It's 623 a.m. And what are we making today? Well, we're going to make French toast. We've got our skillet, pure cast iron heating up, made inside the center of a star when it's supernovae, billions of years ago. Collected on the planet Earth, formed into a pan. All right. And we've got this French brioche pumpkin twist. Here you go. You can get your own pumpkin brioche twist. Hopefully they're still selling it. I had some. And uh, what are the ingredients that are going to be in here? Ah, eggs, milk, pumpkin spice, which is just a bunch of spices all together. Um, vanilla, butter, and berries. So, um, ta -da. I'm kind of doing this by eye because I've done it a lot, and it doesn't mean I get it right every time, but I just don't really feel like using the measuring cup. Okay, that's probably enough, maybe a little light. Let's see. Ooh, that was almost an eggy disaster. Wow. I was lucky. That's what happens when you're up early sometimes. You're a little klutzy. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's pretty good. Now what do I need? Ah, I need this. The whisker. Or whisk. Not the whisper of a cat. I wonder if those were the original whisks. Probably not. Nice. You know, I don't like to leave this thing in here because it tends to, you know, if I imbalance it for a minute. Uh, sometimes what happens makes things a little messy. I did not get that on the screen. All right, now that's the main thing: the eggs and the milk. Then we've got our pumpkin spice. Which as you can see, all the different things in there: cinnamon, nutmeg. Not Ginger, allspice, and clove. The GR, I guess, stands for ground. Now, it is holiday time. Uh-oh. The dog's barking out there, but I don't see her. Well, she's gonna, she wants to play with the big boys out there. Let's see what happens. I'm just kidding. I never let anything happen to a little Mimi bear. If I could stop it. And if I had to go fight the lion. But fortunately there's no lions in New Jersey out of the zoo that I know of. Wow, this one is heavy. You know what? This Crown Royale thing, man. I don't know, they have some cheesy commercials. But they're kind of fun. I don't know, I always think of, uh, I don't know if it was in that movie, um, Pulp Fiction, but it sounds like something those characters would have been drinking. So, well, what am I going to do with this? I'm going to plop a little in here. Yeah. I don't have to go crazy. Yeah, that's good. See, now that we've got that... Gonna be a French Canadian whiskey, French toast, pumpkin thing going on. All right. Uh, almost don't need the vanilla after that, but wow, 
This thing is tight, man. This is tighter than a preacher's wallet. And most of those TV preachers, man, their wallet's like a shark's mouth. Just goes in. Nothing comes out. All right. So this goes on after we put our spices on. We've got this, our Grand Royale. We've got our milk. We close that up, I think. Um, all right, I guess it's time to get a piece. Make sure I took that wax paper off. Put it in there. Let that soak a minute. Gotta open the butter. I like when you have a whole stick of butter because it's just easier to handle. That's pretty good. Beautiful. Oh, the pan's gonna be hotter than the hinges of hell. Not Dante's Inferno, which is cold. All right, so I think this thing is pretty good. Now, to make this spillage a little less, I'm gonna put it there. Look at our butter. I'm gonna find where the pooch went. Maybe she's in a life and death struggle. Oh, there you are. Well, there you have it, folks. I mean, uh, I'll probably come back with a short when I finish cooking them. And um, but that's how you basically do it then, when you want to eat it. If you get your favorite fruits. Today, I think I want to try these blackberries with some powdered sugar and um, maybe a little syrup. So, there you go. It's a delicious French toast. Made with pumpkin brioche twist and, you know, jazzed up a little bit with um, that uh, Crown Royale 
French Canadian whiskey should be quite scrumptious. Yum. Hey, thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye for now.